Howdy folks, welcome to the second edition of my Civics and 60 playlist, part of the BA Social Studies channel. Today I'm going to try and, to, and explain the social contract theory um, and where it comes from. So in order to do so, it's going to be interesting trying to squeeze that into 60 seconds. I'm going to have to give background on the Age of Enlightenment and also the divine right theory. So I'm up to the challenge if you are. Let's get ready and start the clock. All right, the idea of social contract comes from a period known as the Enlightenment, which took place during the late 1600s all the way through the 1700s and kind of developed and changed over time. Okay, during that period, people began to question whether religion was the cause of all things that took place and started to look at reason and science as the reason for things that took place. So these ideas eventually spread into political ideology and people began to question whether the monarchs who said that they were given their power by God or a group of gods or their deities had the power that they said was given to them. So naturally, people began to question that and move away from that idea and began to create governments where the people had control. That's the social contract. In social contract, people have control. All contracts are between two parties, right? So these two parties in this contract are the government and the people. Okay, the people. Number one, people have the power to create the government under social contract, and in return, they have to follow the rules. Okay, if they don't follow the rules, then the government can't imprison them or take their property. Uh, number two, the government, the second party, uh, they must protect the basic rights of the people. And if they don't do that, then the people have the right to alter, change the government, or abolish the government. So hopefully that opens up uh, what social contract is to you really quickly. Uh, I know that was short, brief, but hopefully it takes care of what you need to do. 60 seconds is short, and that's a challenge for me there to squeeze all that in. So hopefully it's enough. Hopefully I'll be able to go into depth later on uh, in another video. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe to BA Social Studies, and peace.